Hi, I'm Minister Ralph Friedrichs. Making a difference is my belief. Here's my challenge to everyone. I just want to challenge everyone, a challenge I'm also trying to live out. No matter how busy you are, there is always something you can do to brighten someone's day. Give someone a hug. Send a text with an inspiring quote. Friends, mail a heartfelt card. Tell someone how much you appreciate him or her. If we look, each day presents us with opportunities to share kindness throughout the world. My core belief that we are called to not only love God and love people, but to carry out the Great Commission and share the eternal message of Jesus Christ. My goal is to help you reimagine your life and let go of the thoughts and behaviors that undermine you so that a renewed and fulfilled you can emerge starting today. We must love one another as God loves each and every one of us. To be able to love, we, my friends, need a clean heart. Prayer is what gives us a clean heart. The fruit of prayer is deepening of faith, and the fruit of faith is love. I hope each and every one of you remember to show compassion and have a, a great life ahead of you with Jesus Christ. Good morning, my name is Ralph Freaks, I'm an uh, addiction recovery coach at Life Coach and Minister and the host of this show, Take Your Life Back Today radio show. You can see a video version of this if you go to YouTube under our channel, Take Your Life Back Today show. You can also hear us on iHeart Radio, iTunes, and Google Music. I want to be able to say amen to begin with. To start with, I want to say amen. If you know who you are, you can say that and not wait for anybody else to say it for you. If you know what God has spoken, if you know where you come from, you can start with amen. Jesus wasn't waiting on anyone, anybody else for an amen. He had an amen that would come from within. I personally think we've lost that. I think we are so consumed with the voices of others that we can't even hear our own Father. Then we start asking God to take away things that we put in our heart through the wrong voices. But today, right now, the Lord said it's going to be a better week and weekend for you because you're going to begin every day with an amen. When you wake up, you say amen. And if you agree with this video and radio, say amen. Call me at 844 help together you and I. We can help each other take our lives back. Be good to yourself and always be good to each other. Remember, a simple smile to anyone can change their day and change their life and make a difference in your life. Instead of waiting to say amen at the end, start each day with an amen. And God loves you and Jesus loves you. Amen.